Today I'm starting a project that I've had for like the last year and a half and it's coming to be 2019 now. So I'm gonna go ahead and start tearing down the engine of uh, my blown motor or supposedly blown motor. So I'm gonna go ahead and see what's wrong with it. So pretty much all I've been doing is, is going through and cleaning up the motor before I start taking it apart. So I wanna take it apart, see what the underlying issue is, why it was losing some um, compression. So once I do that, then I can figure out what I wanna do and if I could go ahead and get this motor built. So get parts lined up, all that other good stuff. Over here is my next uh, project I gotta tackle. And it's pretty much a 2008 335 XI. Uh, ugh, it's a pain in the butt. But yeah, it looks pretty clean. I just washed it a while ago, so yeah. Has a flat tire, I got some tires that came with it. So we're gonna have those put on, but uh, black interior, automatic, uh, paddle shifters, and no iDrive though. So my baby right here. I still have to, everything's still running good on it, so what I gotta do right now is I gotta go ahead and, just open. So what I gotta do is go ahead and fix the headliner and the sunroof uh, cover piece. So yeah, everything on this car is pretty much interior I gotta deal with, and then the fenders. This is just a summation of all the stuff I'll be doing in the next couple weeks. So I'm going to, was it, I'm driving to Texas, so I'm gonna be out for a, a good period of time. So when I come back, that's when I'm gonna be getting everything ramped up and started. So what's coming up right now is pretty much a compilation of all the stuff that I have accomplished from this year, which is not a lot, but it seems, I'm looking through the footage, I'm like, wow, I did get some, a lot of stuff done. So, uh, all right, see y'all in the new year. So it looks so much better now. It's been curing for a couple of days, so I could walk on it. So within the next couple of days, I'm gonna go ahead and start putting stuff in here, back.
I'm just gonna go in here and start cleaning out inside here and um, getting all this gunk. But yeah, it's some pretty strong stuff, so yeah. When you first open it, it's gonna smell bad. But I'm pretty much using this for my wheels. Um, they pretty much work pretty good. So what I like about it is that it leaves a coating on it. So even when you put water on it, it splashes off and it's easy to just wipe off dirt and clean. So if I do this like at least once every six months or so, uh, these things should stay pretty clean all the time. Nope, can't, it busted. It's literally busted. I gotta go home and get a new one. So a new one is in. Well, these are tires off right now and as you can tell this is pretty bad uh, yeah but the good thing is at least I can see the wear it wears pretty evenly across so at least my alignment's still good this piece goes through on here so you're able to turn it and I guess pivot this out um, giving you good enough angle to go ahead and get the rolling started so I'm gonna get my bolts and start on this actually that took as short a time as possible see now it's spinning and what I did was I went ahead and got this and I like moved it that way so like it was seized up so now I should go ahead and be able to start getting some cool air in here here we go nice cool air coming out what got this one there we go So hopefully it just was stuck closed with that rust so by running a little bit more now it should stay lubricated but at least now I know I need to go ahead and swap that thing out soon. So let's go ahead and try and see if this is actually blown cool. There are lots of children roaming these streets and we cannot have them run over. <laughs> 